Hello YouTube. I don't know if you can hear that fan in the background. Uh, old noisy 50 amp power supply. Uh, I mean it's noisy. <laughs> you can't talk on the radio with that power supply right there. Cheap ass power supply. Works good as a test uh, on the test bench. But if you're going to use it to run an amp or a radio, you better forget it. Don't use, I don't even know, uh, you don't even have a name on it. It's one of these Chinese knockoffs like all of them are. But this just happens to be one that's uh, a little too noisy for what we use them for. As you can see, I don't know if you see right in there, uh, uh, right above that variable, there's a little, a little piggyback uh, resistor there. That's a little mod I've done to it to get some extra voltage out of it. Right now I'm at uh, 15 volts, and I'll explain what I'm doing in just a second. I got a uh, 2980. I'm on a dummy load cantina. I'll show you what this radio does. And this radio also has a built-in amp, but this is with the amp off. It's 10-watt slug. Coming, uh, got a little two-pill Dave made. Coming all going around in and then out under the table to the uh, dummy load. Here's what the radio, I think I got it set at about 2 watt. Looks like about 2 watt day key. Oh, oh, that's RMS. I do have a peak, uh, peak kit on this, but it. The peak kit is off. I'm in the center position. 10 watt. Oh, this is a radio that I did a little tuning on. And my friend down south uh, did a little tuning on it. And between the both of us, we got it going, got it doing over 10 birds. So, uh, nice radio. Not going to show you any peak on it because what this is about is not the radio. I recently uh, seen a video about some guys had uh, radio for sale online and uh, and uh, had a built-in amplifier, I believe it's a four peel and they were uh, claiming 1200 watts I said man that thing gonna catch on fire but uh, I got to looking at it and I watched the video uh, and they were using meter just like this one actually two of them two of them side by side had one on RMS and one on uh, peak. Thousand watt slugs, but this is a this is a ten watt right now. I, actually, I'm gonna show you. Uh, I'm gonna turn this around, and show you my reflect coming off of my dummy load. Hello, 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 hello. Mine don't even move. Look at there. Turn it back around. Hello, hello, hello. Anyway, let's pull this out. We'll put this 500 in, and then we'll get on with the test. Ah, I didn't want to click that in, but I did. But that's okay, I'm going to leave it in there. 500 watt slug. Radio, say hello, hello. Barely moving, it. about 40, look like 40. No, not 40. <laughs> what am I talking about? <laughs> uh... But let's do a test here real quick. What I was uh, getting at before I rudely interrupted myself <clears throat> is uh, the video was about a 1200 watt radio, but they, they were, I wasn't seeing on the bird on the RMS uh, meter, I wasn't seeing but 225 to 250, 250 watts. And I got to thinking, how do you get 220, how do you do 225 bird or 250 bird? And calculate it to come out and, and peak it. How, how do you get 1,200? I, I don't understand. Let me show you what I'm getting. And this is a whole different scenario, I know. And I'm not a hater. I just, I just, uh, I, I just want to understand. I want somebody to explain it to me because I don't understand it. But let me show you what I get with 225, 250, and even higher if I, if I decide to go that high. But uh, let's start out right here. I'm going to cut this. Uh, I'm at 15. I'm going to run it right there at 15 volts. I got an amp meter. 
show an amperage I'm drawing and it's not going to be much over 30 about 35 at the most but let's start at 15 and see what we actually what we're doing this is RMS do that again we're going to run on about a 50 watt dead key let's get the dead key 50 watt dead key oh yeah Oh, hello, 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 looks like about a 170, 180 RMS, wouldn't you agree, okay, got a built-in amp on this radio, about an 80 watt, cut it on, so we're going to put a little drive on it, I got our dead key up a little higher than I wanted to, so I'm going to back off the dead key, Put it right out there, right about a hundred. Oh, you. Oh, oh, a little over two hundred bird. Okay, that's good. Let's. I tell you what. Let's look at. Uh, well, let's we'll check the voltage. Oh, you, oh, you, oh, you. Voltage is actually trying to climb. Amps. Audio. Oh, hello. One, two, three, four. Hello. Audio. Oh, about 30, 31 amps. Hello, 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 hello. Okay, let's, I tell you what. So that's about 220 bird RMS. Let's, uh, we know it's going to pick out to 500. That's 500 watt slug. We, so we're going to go to the, I got my, my two times down. And there's my peak. So let's see. We actually will be looking at the bottom scale. So, uh, I mean, you can figure, calculate in the middle if you want to, but. I mean, it's the same thing as the bottom scale would be. It's 1,000 watt. That's what we're going on. So there's, I'm getting a little modulation. There's a little bit over 100 watt key. Audio. Oh, a little over 500, right? Huh? That's 220. 220. And I'm only getting five. five let's try it again. Audio. Oh, Audio. Oh, yeah, about 530, 520, 530 peak. Yeah, that sounds more reasonable. Uh, I tell you what, let's, let's, let's turn the bird. Maybe we can pig this 1,000 watt out. If they're, if they're getting 1,200 with 225 or 250 bird, I should be able to pig this. I tell you what I'll do. Well, let's turn the voltage up. I'm going to turn it up to 17, and we'll try this again real quick, and then I'm going to be done. Hold on just a second. I'll let you see it firsthand. Let's go all the way to 17. There we go. Here we go. Keep eye on it. It's getting there. Tell you what. Let's see. Let's try to get it there. There it is. Okay. Let's go back to RMS. Let's go back to BIRD. Go back to center position on the on the switches on the uh, aftermarket peak switch there. So we're on regular 500 scale now, bird. RMS, 100 watt dead key. Oh, hello, 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 hello. Oh, just a tad over 250 RMS. Hello, 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 hello. So you know what? I should be getting, you know, if my theory... It's like theirs. I should be getting pretty close to a thousand peak, right? Okay, let's try it. Let's see what happens. 17 volts. Audio, hello, 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 hello. 34 amps. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, 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 hello. Dropping uh, 0.4. I bet power supply is starting to smell a little bit, too. <laughs> uh... We're going to we're going to the thousand scale. We're going to peak. There it is. Five hundred watt scale should be times two. Five hundred watt slug times two. Then went my voltmeter, cutting off and cut it back on. Let's try it again. Now here we go. A little over a hundred uh, watt dead key RMS thousand watt scale to bottom scale. Let's see if we can peg it out. We should be able to. They're doing it. They're doing two and a, 225, 250. 
and pegging out getting 1200 let's see I should be able to do it with that good with that uh, 10 plus bird radio I mean, it shouldn't be no problem and then I've got it I got an 80 watt drive on it too let's see what happens oh oh audio hello 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 come on a thousand come on a thousand hello 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 it ain't gonna happen so I don't understand maybe somebody can help me out on this one how they can get 250 bird and equate it to 1200 PP on the same type meter uh, I am using a 500 slug times two but they they used a thousand slug and they go they go to the times two and to to show the 1200 so tell me why or what's what's the difference I don't understand somebody help me out I appreciate y'all watching <laughs> catch y'all later mm555 NC I'm gone